What does teaching mean to me? I'd have to refer to my favourite quote. To me, a teacher is someone who active is a compass that activates the magnets of curiosity and knowledge and wisdom in pupils. So what do you think of Wanker? <sighs> Wanker. This isn't my office. It's always in the way. Hey, Alex, this is a good risk assessment, good detail. Um, yeah, my name is uh, Georgia. Um, I'm uh, 18. I go here. Georgia, can't have you doing this sort of thing in class or college. Um, it's the media one. Um, it's got like, um, like lots of writing and um, filming in it. So it's like, um, yeah, it's a bit of everything. It's good. Uh, wow. Well, the course is alright, but the teacher's in. It's locked. Reading Fifty Shades of Grey. Still educational. On sex ed. Um, sorry, if you're like, looking for sex ed classes, we do run this uh, in the What's your mark say? Yeah. That's what I thought. This, this isn't the youth club. Uh, did you just touch me? Oh. The worst thing he's ever done is touch me. Yeah, you just really um, yeah, can you not move on the interception? You've got to get up and push my talk and move the time. You're not touch. Touch the breast. You touch the yeah, breast. He didn't repeat the spot. We are repeat the spot. I can see it. Everyone can see it. Listen, if you keep on, you're going to have to go out to the class. Repeat the spot. Okay, come with me. Get out. Like, get out of here. Get out. Get out. Get out. Yeah, he essentially did, like, mm. I turned that on. Actually, my favourite quote is, uh, You shall not pass! Gandalf, right? Because in that scene, he's protecting the fellowship from the great Balrog. And, I mean, like, they're, they're gonna die. I mean, risks his own life to save them, and I feel like, but I am Gandalf, and I'm protecting my students, my fellowship, my hobbits, from the Balrog. Yep. Yeah? Wayne, we've had parents ring it. None of them have returned home. Did you speak to Mr. Kerr? Did I speak to Mr. Kerr about the incident? Yes. Um, I did, yes. Um, so I spoke to Wayne. Um, very, very kind of professional and um, friendly, informal discussion about the, the, the minor incident. Um, so I'm just making some motivational posters from students. Um, how about them on my favourite posters? They say the best motivation is demotivation, according to Wikipedia, this big list. So I'm going for some of that. How many students have I got? Wayne, we uh, yeah, how many students have I got? Wayne, you should know that question, it's an obvious question. We need to talk about the incident. Um, he was fine with it, he accepted that he shouldn't have put his hand on the student's shoulder. That was inappropriate. Before I speak to the press, I'm a little bit annoyed with the fact that we've got the press involved with this. Um, well, see, they see, any publicity is good publicity, so... Having the college, myself, you, and our students on the front page of the Evening Standard, you know, college in disarray, no, no, no that's not that what we want. Anyway. That's besides the point of not getting into a debate about who reads what paper. 
The issue we have here is the fact that our reputation is going down the drain because of you and your stupidity. Now run through with me why the hell we ended up on that newspaper. So, in life, any situation can come right, out I'm of anywhere. This is, this is what I'm sick of. This crap. He's a, a, a fantastically talented man. Um, we're very lucky to have someone um, as artistic as him on board. Um, he's got a really good rapport with the students. The students seem to <coughs> respond quite well to him. Um, and yeah, he's, he's, he's come a long way since he, he first started here, um, kind of three years ago. But he's, he seems to have fitted in well, the department. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's, he's okay, yeah. He's a nice guy, he's a, he's a nice guy, he's, he's, he's great. That comes out of your mouth. Just get to the point. Tell me what the issue is. What happened? So I was having a normal class, and then, um, well, I was a student, not the she was told, and uh, she started to act up, so I attempted, and I believe successfully, uh, and appropriately, responded, and the class... What do you mean, appropriately? What did, did you touch her? I tried to remove her from the classroom. Oh dear god. Wayne, what do you mean you tried to remove her from the classroom? She wouldn't leave when I told her to, so I moved her. How? Just pulled her arm. He accepts that, um, but he was trying to calm her down. And I can see sometimes how things can progress and get out of control. Um, you know, we're not running a youth club here. Right, just teachers. No, 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 no. Late to. You look in 10, 11 students in a classroom trying to remove eleven. one. It doesn't matter how many. It doesn't matter. I don't care if it's 10, it's 12, it's 15. At the end of the day, you locked students in a classroom and I had parents outside. I had the newspaper and I had the local TV station stood outside wanting me to give a statement about events that happened. Okay? You need to cut this stupidity. I thought you coming in that day wearing those speedos was bad enough. You need a swim trip. You're a media teacher. You shouldn't be organising swim trips. It's inappropriate. That's it. End of story. This is the final warning now. I want nothing else. Wayne, are you, are you singing? Final warning. Final warning. That's it. She's a joke at that one. Oh, she, uh, she likes to mess with us. So, never serious though. Motivation right there. Motivation. It's the final countdown to you know, at the end of the day, um, it's a difficult job that we do here, um, and I respect Mr. Kerr, um, and I'm pretty certain that you know this is this will be fine. The situation will be blown over once he's given his statement to the local press this afternoon. Um, I'm actually quite upset, to be honest, um, to say the least, really, that our reputation is being undermined and brought down by um, childish and youth-like comments, gossip. Um, I'm sorry, good at can you just cut that? Uh, it was just a simple exercise, blown completely out of proportion, but fine, we're all fine. Uh, just me and the students were just having a joke, like a bit of banter between me and Connor and Everyone. Bounce. Um, anyway, I have a lesson now and I don't want to be late, so... Um. I may have made a bit of a mistake and um, basically I didn't do it. Hello, Mum. That's my mum. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
Okay, guys, my name is Jordan. We're not running to the top yet. We are. Haven't you changed? 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 Haven't